having taught it for a term with the children, they absolutely love it. It's so fresh and new. They haven't really done anything with filming and thought about film from behind the camera point of view before. And so the children are just loving it. And so are we. Just from the work we did this morning, this one lesson this morning, I was amazed at how the children got to what I would consider our like, higher level thinking about literacy and higher level use of language. The idea that a child was using a phrase like ambience, the ambience. I mean, that, that's a word you aspire them to use, but in general, unless you actually tell them what it means and plant it there, they don't come up with it. For the vast, vast majority of teachers that we've worked with, they say that film has changed the way that they teach. It's changed the way that children engage with them and it's really switched them onto writing and reading in the classroom. Within the Bradford Media Literacy Study over the three years of the project, the children have demonstrated above average progress in writing, which was the original aim of the project. But as a, a spin-off, there's also been an improvement in their reading results, particularly because we can use film to develop children's reading comprehension. Our standardised assessment tests that we do in England to assess children's literacy skills, we saw that this year there was a dramatic increase in the percentage that we achieved. So this year our results were 93% that achieved a level 4 in reading and the previous year it had been 77%. So we saw a dramatic increase in the number of children that were achieving the level 4. We feel that the percentage increase this year was a result of using the film project. It's had an incredibly positive impact. Um, I've taught it now within three different ages. The main part first was the um, engagement of the boys who were very switched off to literacy. The boys just flew with it straight away. They actually said they didn't see it as an English lesson. The natural progression from what we're doing in class already, and because some children maybe don't have the the de decoding abilities of others, it levels the playing field for them and that, that really helps them, I think. Working with Into Film has been wonderful. They have experts to answer all the questions, all the little technical things that we struggle over, but also they're very good at reassuring us that what we're doing in school is really good and also put in, helping us to put it into the context of education. They know about education as well as knowing about film and so it's really good to work with them and also just have that backup when we need it. So the quality of the CPD has been really good because it, it, it's pitched at teachers and allows them to become comfortable in incremental steps. But also I think probably the biggest benefit of the CPD really is, is the people who are delivering it. The, the, the quality of the staff who deliver the CPD really have, have been instrumental in, in, in making sure that it, it's been effective. It's designed specifically with teachers in mind and, and with teacher development in mind. And that's really where I feel the benefits are. I've been involved in delivering CPD and been in the receiving end of CPD for the best part of 15 years now. And I would definitely say that the standard of CPD that we're receiving within the Indofilm project is, is some of the best that I've witnessed. It is so beneficial in terms of literacy skills, group work skills, communication, teamwork. There are so many different benefits from this project and I absolutely will continue doing it. Um, even with younger children, you can take little bits of it and use it with them. But I really do think it is something which in this day and age will be of a benefit to every year group every year. <laughs>